There is Bellucci, there's Malik, and these young graduates are going to show us, display skills they've acquired from the Rad Academy, anchored by the one and only Abu Ghazal. These young riders are going to show us, display their skills in poise, balance, grip, and in the process they will show us their temperament, their horsemanship, control, these are all features that are necessary for you to not only be a competent rider, but to be a proficient polo player. Grip, balance, grip, your temperament, and you've got to be fearless, obviously. And to back that up, you need some talent, obviously. Um, so, we have special guests amongst us, if you just got here. Is Lagos' best kept secret. We have the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. And accompanying them as the Chief of Defense staff and his lovely wife. They've been led by the President and the Captain of the Club to the VIP Grandstand. And once we have them settled in into their seats, we're going to have a display by young members of the Riding Academy. I'm particularly looking forward to seeing Eyitemi. And like I said, these young riders are going to display skills they've acquired from the Rider Academy. The instructor, Mashal himself, Abu Ghazal, is going to coordinate that process. And all of this, obviously, is in aid of Nigerian Concord, in collaboration with Victor's Games. And that's a platform to raise awareness, the recovery path process for wounded veterans and active members of Nigerian Army. So Nigeria Unconquered is a Nigerian foundation. Invictus is a global brand founded by Prince Harry, raising awareness, the recovery path for wounded veterans and active members of the armed forces so it can't be underestimated what they go through not only in serving and being selfless but in the process sometimes they get injuries some of sometimes life-threatening sometimes they are permanently incapacitated so the work of both these foundations raises awareness there's a fundraiser today in a marquee to the right of the commentary box, all ticketed. So all of you that have bought tickets, it's money going to a very, very worthy cost. And that's in aid of our wounded veterans that have been fearless, selfless in providing security and safety to our country. So worthy chairs goes to Nigerian Concord, but we're particularly proud of having amongst us the founder of Invictus Games, the Prince of Sussex himself is here. Shame he's not playing polo with us today. But I'm sure the president of the club will make sure we correct that sometime in the future. We would love to have Prince Harry play polo amongst us. The Duke of Gloucester obviously played in the 70s, so there's precedence to the House of Windsor. The Duke of Gloucester played polo here many, many decades ago in the 70s. Then he was first secretary in the British High Commission. He was a diplomat and obviously a member of the royal family. He played in the 70s. He was a good friend to the then head of state, General Yakubu Gowon. So, so, ladies and gentlemen, the moment has come now for us to have a display by members. So can we have a round of applause, please? We have the first graduate that's, that looks like Eyitemi Olashuju. He yeah, I don't know all their names. So that's Eyitemi Olashuju. Please, can we put a round of applause, please? The second one? The second guy? All right, please, let's put our hands together for the second graduate. He's showing... 
Yep, you can see his poise. You can see the balance. Oh, yeah, okay, that's very. Oh, yeah, Oreagba. Ah, and we have Malik Oreagba also. So you can see the Oreagbas in the black and red helmets. And who's bringing up the rear? Who's the. Oh, that's instructor. That's instructor. So, yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, these young riders are showing poise. They're showing their grip. They're showing balance. All right. And the lady is Bellucci. And Bellucci is showing you poise in the saddle. She's showing her grip. You need dexterity. And just look. Yeah, the Oreagbas are clearly very confident. Ayitim is all obviously holding the mallet, so he's ready to start playing chuckers, I believe. The lady being held by Abu Dagazao is Baluchi. So those young boys are showing competence, balance, poise. Right, so Abu Dagazao is putting Belichi through our paces. So you can see she's showing poise. There's grip. Yeah. That's a fine, fine job. It's all about the grip there. Between the thighs and the saddle. So. Wow, so we have other graduates from the Rada Academy, they are holding Nigerian flags, they are right in front of the VIP stand, so they are being introduced. Yeah. So those kids from the Rada Academy that are not riding have been introduced to the Duke and Duchess. So the Oreagbas, Ayitemi and Bellucci are doing a fine job of displaying their recently acquired skills in the saddle led, mentored, instructed by Abu Dagazao. And those are the children from the Rider Academy having a wave. So ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together, please. Let's put our hands together, please, for the wrong graduates for the Rider Academy. It's no mean feat. It takes a lot of heart. It takes a lot of courage. It takes determination to competently, confidently control a horse. And uh, yes, I'm particularly proud. Ah, I can see Nimi. I can see Nimi. Yep, yeah, there you go. Nimi is holding a horse. Yep, yep, that's control. Yep, yep, well done. And we can see the graduates led by Mr. J.D. Martins. So, well done, J.D. Martins. So, after this, we're going to have two chuckers. So after this display by the young graduates from our riding academy, we're going to have two chuckers. We're going to have two teams, Team Duke and Team Duchess. Yes. So we have two chuckers coming up. Team Duke, Team Duchess. Two quick chuckers, then after that we're going to have a presentation anchored by the Duke and Duchess, accompanied by the President, the Captain, and the Chief of Defence Staff, right? The Chief of Defence Staff and his wife for the presentation ceremony. Yep, I left out the President's wife also, Mrs. 
Bell, 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 Bell. Chuck out. Bell. No, wait, wait. Guys, come on. Ring the bell, ring the bell. Put So very shortly we're gonna we're gonna have two chuckers. So Team Duke, Team Duchess are gonna play two chuckers of exhibit polo, exhibition polo, in honor of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. So we have a team in a blue strip and we have a team in a red strip. I'm yet to find out which team is which. Can we have both teams on the field, please? We can't keep our VIPs waiting. So, can we have both teams on the field, please? We're going to have a ceremonial rolling. Scratch. So, we're just going to start chopping. All right. I need to know who the players are. Yeah. Players, please, for Team Duke and Team Duchess, please. We run out of time. So the umpires for this match will be Ndako and Abu Dagazao. No, Lulu's not playing. That's not correct. Lulu's not playing. Lulu's not playing. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. That's Tola Kiyomi. That's that's uh, that's Sadiq Dantata. That's Yemo and Okwe. So that's Naomi. That is rude to me. So that's Naomi. All right. So for Team Duke, Team Duke will be the team in red, and I can see the captain of that team will be Sadiq Dantata. There's Tola Kiyomi. Okay. All right. So Team Blue are Team Duke. Team Red are Team Duchess. So very quickly, I'm going to announce the teams. Yemi? Yemi? Are we going to introduce the players? we should all right very quickly we're going to introduce the players so have a line out we're going to quickly introduce the teams so both teams line out as stride the umpire whilst we introduce so the team in, in blue a team duke all right first up for team duke at one is naomi durasaro naomi Put your hands together for Naomi Dursar. At two, we have Funcho George. Round of applause for Funcho George. At three, we have Rotimi Marco Jala, past captain of the club, the brother of the president of the club. And shutting the back door is Dante himself, Dantala Ibrahim. Round of applause for Dantala. So for Team Duchess, quickly, at one, we have Okbe Oyulala. At two, we have Tola Kiyomi. At three, we have Polo Prince himself, royalty, Yemo Alakija. And I believe shutting the back door is Sadiq Dantata. Round of applause for Sadiq. So there are two teams, Team Duke in blue. Team Duchess in red. So the two umpires for this match are Abu Dagazao and Ndako. The third man, I believe, is Osama Debs.
So, ladies and gentlemen, we're just about to commence an exhibition match between two fine teams, two club teams, in honor of the presence of the Duke and Duchess. So, immediately, Okwe Oyinola, brought up there by Yemo, sent it long. Okwe on the charge of the far side. He's got that to that for company. Okwe cuts it towards goal. Is that goal? Oh, what a great goal! Great, great 60 yard goal. Cut shot there, played by Okpe Oyinola. Great one two punch there. That was set long by Yemo Lakija and converted with great, great skill was Okpe Oyinola. So, first blood drawn by Team Duchess. That's the team in red. All right, Yemo on the charge. Remo sends it long again. Yemo, who's there first? I uh, picked on the near side there. Send now, go bound again. Who's on the charge now? Rotimi. me. Rotate me, Makaudala. Rotate me. Rotate me. Is he going to convert this? Wow. Two quick goals there. And that is a goal quickly scored there by Rotimi, me, on the far side. So that's one each to Team Duke and Team Duchess. Ball brought out on the far side. Dantala, Dantala sends it long, right into the path of Rotimi again. Picked up there now by Yemo. Yemo, Yemo's got Naomi for company. Oh, Yemo's had his pocket picked. Picked up there by Okbe. Okbe still on child, leaves it behind. Who's got the ball? Not quite sure. It's a bit of a melee. Who's there? Rotimi, Rotimi on the charge. Gliding past the halfway point. But unfortunately, he's got Sadiq Dantata for coming on the near side. He plays and misses on the near side. Missed again. And who's there to pick up the slack now? That's Yemo. 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 Yemo still on the charge. Oh, great hook there by Rutimi. Great hook there. Sadiq. Sadiq Dantata plays it right into the path of Okbe. Okbe, Oyinola. Okbe. Okbe still on the charge on the far side. Okbe, is he going to convert it again like he did in the first minute? No, he plays and misses. Dantala picks it up. Dantala, Dantala, Dantala on the far side. He's had his pocket picked. Is he going? Oh, wow, that's a foul has been spotted and the whistle's gone. And wait to see whose favor that penalty is going to be awarded to. All right, all right, ball in play on the far side. Brought out there by Yemo. Yemo for Team Duchess. Sends it long. But who's there? Who's there? Attempt is made there by Funcho George. He plays and misses on the near side. Who picks it up again? Looks like Yemo. Yemo's got the ball. Yemo changes direction, sends it. But doesn't quite get the distance. Who's there? Funcho George. Fungsho Joe plays it forward to maintain line. Tickles it. Plays a great tail shot there. Intercepted there by Rotimi. Rotimi, Marco Ajola. Rotimi tails. Attempts a tail shot. Misses. Picks up there on the near side by Yemo. Yemo's had his pocket picked there by Dantala. Dantala. Dantala's got Tola Akiomi for company. Dantala. Dantala sends it long. Who's there first? Looks like Naomi. Naomi. What's Naomi going to do? Naomi. She plays it under the belly. Great angle tail shot there by Okpe Oyinola. There's a bit of a melee on the far side. There's Rotimi. Rotimi has got Tolaki on me for company. And for all his endeavor, a foul has been spotted. And that looks as they were going forward. That looks like it's going to be a penalty for. Yep, that looks like a penalty four from my vantage point. That's a 60 yard penalty in favor of Team Duke. I beg your pardon, that looks like a penalty three. Yeah, that's a 40 yard penalty. Can you tell why? Is it 40 yard? Look at this one. So that's a penalty. That's a penalty. Three. It's a 40 yard penalty. That's what all of them are behind the goal line. That's how I knew. 
And that goes wide. Attempt is made there by. What attempt is that just now? Uh, who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? George. Well, that's gone wide, so that'll be a hitting on the back side, on the back line to Team Duchess. So, Team Duchess, that's brought out there by Yemo. Yemo changes direction, changes path of least resistance, right into the path of Okpe. Oh, that's a long one play there, right into the path of Okpe Onyilola. Oh, he doesn't quite get there, Dantala. Dantala has all the time in the world turns. There's a hook there attempted there by Sadiq. Doesn't quite get there. Uh, there's a great tail shot there by Sadiq. Right into the path of Fujo George. Uh, what a great backhand shot there. Who's there first? Naomi. Naomi's called off there by a teammate. Dantala. An attempt made there by Rutimi. Ball is still in play on the far. Who's there? Right in the path now. Yemo. Yemo's got Naomi for company. Yemo. Yemo picks it up on the near side. Claims the line on the ball. Yemo. Yemo still on the charge. Yemo. It's picked up there by Sadiq. Sadiq. Sadiq bumped hard by Naomi. Naomi, great hook there by Naomi. Wrote to me. But that's picked up now by Tola Kiyomi. Naomi plays and misses. Yemo. Yemo now on the charge. Yemo. Yemo, he's got his teammate Tola Kiyomi at line. Yemo sends it long. Yemo is going to attempt a cut shot there. He plays and misses. Backed up there by Sadiq. That's right through the pony. And that's a fine goal there. Scored there by Sadiq on the far side. So that's the second goal on the ball for Team Duchess. So if you just got here, it's all about charity today. We're particularly proud to have amongst us the Chief of Defence Staff and his lovely wife. We also have the patron, the founder of Invictus Games, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. So it's all about charities, fundraising for wounded veterans, raising awareness for their plights, their road to recovery, their road to rehabilitation. So all the money raised today is going to a worthy cause for our servicemen. On the bully shot there, played by Naomi. Great shot there. Picked on the near side by Yemo. <laughs> Yemo's had his pocket pick there. Dantala plays, misses, and that goes wide. And we are cruising, almost coming to the end of this first chucker. This first chucker is essentially an exhibition match between two club teams in honor of our distinguished guests, the Duke, Duchess of Sussex, and the Chief of Defense Staff and his lovely wife here gracing us today, raising awareness for the good work that Nigerian Conquer do, and also the fine work done globally by the Invictus Games Foundation in honor of wounded veterans across the globe. So back to Polo now. Dantala sends it wide. Right. That's the first buzzer. 30 seconds to go. A tail shot attempted on the near side there by Sadiq. A tail shot attempted, executed now by Sadiq. Now picked up there by Dantala. Dantala changes direction. Dantala sends it goal bound. Comes off the pony of Naomi. <laughs> Up there, plays. And misses. Is it going to be made to pay for this by Dantala? Dantala cruising. Five, four. And that's a great goal to bring us to the end of the first chucker. Can we pull a round of applause, please, for players and ponies, please? Thank you very much. Can we have a quick turnaround, please? Players, quick turnaround, quick turnaround. Chop, chop, get on your skates. Quick turnaround. So at the end of the second chucker, we only have two chuckers for this exhibition. After that, the deputy tournament manager is going to signal for us to start preparations for the presentation. At that junction, we'll be inviting. So for the presentation ceremony, we're going to be requesting the company of the chief of defense staff and his wife, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex the president of the club and his lovely wife, the captain of the club, to go. We'll be inviting them to come to the pr presentation enclosure for a presentation for the young children from the Riding Academy. So they have an opportunity to have a handshake, photo up. And I believe if we're lucky, the Duke may say a few words 
And at that junction, he'll be led back into the members' enclosure, led by the president. And after a few handshakes and photo opportunities in the members' enclosure, I believe the Duke and Duchess and the chief defense staff and his wife will be led to the marquee for the fundraiser of our events to the right of the commentary box. Ring that bell, please. Ring that bell. Ring the bell now. Ring the bell. They're not talking to you. Ring the bell. So we're going to be focusing. We're going to be focusing on what we're doing. Right? We're going to get him going. You took control when it's like, are we announcing their names or are we not? We just want to do Chop, 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 chop. Abu, 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 Abu. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Aside from my confidence, how is the, yeah, yeah, yeah. the lingo well, is yeah, yeah. It's Absolutely. Just yeah. Being believing in what you're saying. Yeah. yeah, and just projecting it. Yes. Happy, happy, happy belated birthday. I'll come and give you a hug when I come down. Ah. Oh. I can't miss the opportunity to welcome Miss Chalia Shagaya, a long-standing friend of mine, fashion impresario, designer. She's got a heart of many, she's got many talents. But uh, yes, we welcome Miss Cha Chalia Shagaya amongst us today. Welcome. She's a dear, dear friend of ours. So, all right. So we're about to commence the final chaka. This is, so we're going to play to the first buzzer. Seven minutes of chaka brought out there by Fusha George on the far side. Who's there first? Looks like Yemo. Yemo, I recognize Yemo because he always has a pony with yellow socks on. Always does. So Yemo, one half of the terrible twins. Yeah. And that's picked up there by Tola Kiyomi. He plays and misses. Picked up there by Naomi. Naomi attempts to dribble Yemo. She doesn't quite get this. Rotimi. Rotimi, what's Rotimi going to do? All right, they send it right to the path of Fusho Jo. No, Naomi's got line. Naomi, Naomi. She attempts to go past Sadiq. Sadiq's not having it. Yeah, he rides her off. Oh, she got contact, but uh, that went askew. Picked up there now by Funshaw George. Funshaw George deep into enemy territory. They leave it all behind. Rotimi. Rotimi still on the far side. And that looks... not still in play on the far side. Ball still in play. Okwe. Okwe brings it. He's left it behind for Yemo. Yemo is taking charge. He's going to change direction. No, he goes long. He goes straight down the middle. Uh, almost picked up there by Okwe on the near side. Okwe wants to play two near side shots. Well done, son. Go on. Go on, Okwe. Go on. Well done. Okwe, well done, Okwe. Okwe on the charge. 60 yard, the 40 yard. Oh, he's lost the line. Unlucky son, Dantala. And Dantala has picked it up on the near side. Dantala has got Sadiq. Dantala, Dantala, cool, as calm as ever. Years of experience. Great tail shot there. But for all his endeavor, he was deemed to have done that unfairly. He crossed the line to play that shot. And that was probably going to be the easiest call the umpire is going to make today. Great shot for the camera. Well, illegally, right? Yeah. So we only have this chucker to go. So we're going to play to the first buzzer. So, first buzzer, we, play, we press the bell, eh? Yeah. You know why? The last chuck is always seven minutes, not seven and a half, right? So, we're playing two chuckers or three chuckers. The last chuckers is always seven minutes. Well, this the first the buzzer, chucker. this is the last chucker. Okay. So, we're playing. So, we pre when, when that hooter goes, you press your boo. Yeah? You know the drill. That's it. No, no, no. Because we're playing one chucker. So, three minutes. So, yeah, three minutes gone. It's a 5B penalty. 5B penalty played in the middle of the field. Rotimi on the charge. Rotimi Makajola, the captain, former captain, brother of the president of the club. Rotimi Makajola sends it long. Is that going to be picked up by Funja on the near side? No, he doesn't quite get it. Now that's been picked up there by Sadiq Dantata. Okbe. Okbe leaves it behind for. Okbe still sends it. Sadiq. Sadiq goes away from Funja George. Sadiq. 
Is it going to be a near side shot? Uh, still got the line. Full shot, George. Doesn't quite get the line. Backed up there by Okwe. Okwe. Okwe plays on the near side. Does he get it? Oh, no. Picked up there by Tola. Tola plays and misses on the line. And that rolls harmlessly across the back line. And that'll be a hit in to Team Duke. So Team Duchess have got their nose in front by three goals to two. What's the score? Focus. Rotomi plays and misses. Okpe misses the ball, picked up there by Yemo. Yemo, Yemo for Team Duchess. He's got Naomi for company. Yemo, Yemo. Is he going to leave it behind for Sadiq? No, no. Yes. Ah, oh, he's going to send it for Sadiq. Ah, oh, comes off the pony. He has two tries. Sends it long, right to enemy territories. Okpe going to put finishing touches to this. I'm sure he is. Okpe, Okpe, Okpe does it. And that's the fourth goal for Team Duchess. Four goals to two. Yeah, ball in play. Brought out by Sadiq Kantata. That comes off a pony. Picked up there by Dantala for Team Duke. Dantala, that's going to be a tap in. Look at that great. Don is blonde. And that's a great goal scored there by Dantala. Bring the scores to three goals for Team Duke. Play has been called, sent long by Dantala. Who's going to be there first? The former captain going to get it? Yeah, he plays on the near side. Wait, 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 wait. Whistle. Abu, whistle. Stop play, stop play, stop play. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my understanding that the chief of defense staff and his lovely wife are leaving us, so we have to stop the game momentarily. So ladies and gentlemen, we're practically proud to have amongst us today number one, Nigeria's number one soldier, Chief of Defense Staff, and his lovely wife. So we're particularly proud we've had the number one soldier in the country, Chief of Defense Staff, who's graced us with his company, with his wife, and due to a very hectic schedule he has to leave us so we are particularly proud to have him and i'm sure we look forward to seeing him many many more times in the future a sense of belonging i mean for the first time we see nigerians rallying around again uh, in support of the members of the armed forces especially those who are injured i mean we've lost a couple of friends uh, colleagues uh, a lot of them are injured due to IEDs and other um, uh, attacks during, at, uh, during operations. But this, the, uh, the Duke of uh, Sussex and the Duchess coming to come and celebrate with us uh, means that internationally everybody is aware of the sacrifice Nigerian armed forces have been making. And this is good for us because it increases the morale of our troops. And once they see that they are being honored, they are being appreciated, they will be ready to give him more. That's very wonderful, sir. But, sir, I want to know, are we going to continue after the Duke and the Duchess, they leave? Of course, of course. We've started now. We're going to continue. This will enhance it. This, this has brought a lot of awareness to all Nigerians. And then uh, we're hoping that in 2029, Nigeria will host the Invictus Games. And that's, that's, the, that's the plan we have ahead. Uh, we're also trying to uh, raise funds now to construct a befitting Invictus Centre where we'll treat uh, those injured, those with... Um, uh, mental health issues, uh, the widows, the orphans, and all together. So it's, it's a holistic thing we're doing. And just, so this is just the beginning of it. Thank you very much, sir. We appreciate you. Thank you, ma. Thank you. Thank you.